Hello guys, this is Deepika from MyTutorialRack.com. In this tutorial, we will talk about Salesforce integration. Now, what do you mean by Salesforce integration? When you talk about any company or an enterprise, it is built upon on different different services, and each of these services will might be written in a different programming language, and they might be running on a different pl platform. For example, in a company, they might have a order processing system totally different and deployed on a different platform than the services system which might be deployed or will be using Salesforce. So you might come across scenarios where different applications are running on different platform and they are built in different programming language. Now, in this particular course, we will assume and in the real time also, a lot of time you will see that the applications that you're integrating with Salesforce are deployed on Heroku. Now, what is this Heroku? Heroku is a platform as a service means it gives you a platform on that platform you can build your app you can run your applications you can deploy your application you can manage your applications and those applications which are, you are running on Heroku can be written in any programming language like Java Ruby PHP Python, Node.js, etc. So Heroku is compatible with most of the popular programming languages. Now, in a nutshell, Heroku is a great place to run your apps and your microservices that you can use with Salesforce, and Heroku provides you with different integration methods. Now, what are these integration methods? We will talk about those in the upcoming tutorials. So what we're going to do here is we will have an application which is built on force.com platform and we will try to integrate our application which is running on Heroku platform. And what are those different ways that you can integrate them together? We will see in the next tutorial. Thank you.